Oni of Ife allegedly surprised his wives <laughs> the way they never expected it. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video. We are still on the gist from the palace of Oni of Ife. I'm still your girl, Tochi Willam Sonekwe. Guys, they say this time around, the women are like, what is what is going on? You know, they have always believed that uh, Queen Nami have been using jazz on KBS. But this time around, <laughs> they, I'm sure they will be thinking that uh, she have improved on the quality of jazz that she is using. You know, and uh, this is happening because they also use jazz on him, thinking that uh, their own will be stronger than Queen Naomi's own. But they never know that Queen Naomi's own is divine. Anyways, according to what we are hearing, they said, uh, Auntie Blue Blue and uh, Auntie B, that they have finally decided to leave the palace without drama, but on one condition. You know that uh, we heard that only of a fair, uh, uh, the customary court have served them resolution letter that if any of them refuses to do as the husband say by not moving to the house he provided for them, you know, that the person should be ready to sign the letters and dissolve the marriage with KPS. And we all know that uh, it is going to be a shameful thing. Of course, they are not going to do it. Considering all they went through to be in this marriage, because I'm sure they must have sacrificed a whole lot. Uh, Marian used to say that she did a lot of sacrifices, including sacrificing her children and everything. They are not even talking about the jazz part, how much they must have spent, how they where they have must they, where they must have gone just to ensure that uh, they enter the palace. So when you look at all of these things, you find out that they might not. Uh, they will not sign that letter instead. They will leave the palace because it's still an honor to them that they are still married to the king. That then they are being their marriage with the king is dissolved, even though uh, we know that the marriage is not built on love. It, it, it's it's the kind of contract marriage because of the money and everything. Anyways. They said this time around that uh, these people, these two people, have agreed that they are going to leave the uh, the palace for Queen Naomi, because according to them, they are leaving for Queen Naomi. <laughs> Queen Naomi have used a stronger jazz on the king, and the king have succumbed by telling them that they must leave. According to them, allegedly, allegedly, I want to remind you that all of these gist, they are all alleged information. I do not live in the palace, okay? So their condition is that, for the fact that uh, that Lakey Mansion is the second royal home, is the second palace for the king, because they said if the king is not in Ileife, he will probably be in that Lakey Mansion. So these two are saying that if they must vacate the main palace that is in Ileife for Queen Naomi, that Queen Naomi will have to vacate the royal mansion for them. That there is no how everything will go to Queen Naomi and the Prince Tadenika. Because if you recall, you remember there was a time we heard that the house had been willed to Queen Naomi and the Prince Tadenika. You know? So they are now saying that there is no how Queen Naomi will hold the two important things all to herself. She will be in the palace, she will be in only of the first lucky mansion. That that is not happening. I want to remind you that this this lucky mansion in question is only of a first personal property, personal. But uh, it lives a kingdom. The palace in question does not belong to the king. It is a gated community. It's a community. It's a royal community uh, abode. You know, after only of a another king will come. Another king, that, as a matter of fact, that place houses a lot of uh, royal families, you know. So, uh, it is not a personal property to the king. But the royal mansion in Lake is 
his own personal property. And he has given it to his personal wife. <laughs> you know, his one and only lovely wife and uh, his son. So, but these women are making it look like uh, that uh, Ilefe king of the palace also belongs to the king personal. No, from what we are, we are told, from what we know, or what we have been hearing allegedly, it doesn't belong to him. It's a gated community. Any king that comes up, even after him, will live there. But you cannot tell me that another king that will come up after him will go to claim the lake mansion. No. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. So these people are saying that there is no how when Nomi will hold these two important places and they will be driving out of the palace. It's even better that they go to wherever their husband must have provided for them because they will own that place. Even after, uh, after them, their children will inherit it from them. You know? Because you cannot tell me that the house that the king has given to them, that he is going to will it to Prester uh, Denikau. Uh, uh, well, it's possible because their character sometimes might push him into doing some of the things that... Uh, but I don't think he will do it. He loves his wife so seriously and he respects them a whole lot. Because if you see the way he's talking about them, how they bring different vibes to the table, how he is proud of them and all of that... You will know that the king have a whole lot of respect for these women, but the fact remains that they don't have half of uh, half respect of what the king have for them for the king, because if they do, all of these dramas wouldn't be going on. They, if they love the king half of the way he love and respect them, uh, 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 by now, uh, when Nomi will return, when Nomi will not return, wouldn't have been their problem, you know, because they will join force together with him and ensure that he is happy by bringing back with Naomi, since they find out that that is the only thing that makes him happy. So, they said he told uh, these two people, Auntie Blue Blue and uh, Mariam, who have in, uh, 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 insisted that they will only live on that condition, that she, he is going to be the last thing they must have snatched from with Naomi, that he's not going to fold his arms again and uh, allow any one of them take away anything that belongs to Queen Naomi and Prince Tadenika away again. They said that we are disappointed. Why is it that they are working hard with the with the king and everything is going to Queen Naomi? For how long is it going to continue like that? Won't they have their own children? Won't they do this? Won't they do that? They say no be smarting. Anyways, <laughs> that's their business. Thank God the king is standing his ground right now. Anyway, guys, I want to remind you that these are all alleged information, okay? Always remember that. And thanks for watching. Tell me what you think about it on the comment section. And give my video a thumbs up. Bye for now. Love you guys.